In the med lab, we have developed a robot that delivers two concentric tube robotic arms endoscopically for BPH laser surgery. When a man has BPH, enlarged prostate tissue obstructs urine flow through the urethra and transurethral endoscopic surgery is often required. In one approach, called HOLEP, the surgeon holds an endoscope with a laser fiber running through it and laser resects entire prostate lobes. Another approach, called TERP, the surgeon removes small pieces of the prostate bit by bit with a wire loop. Although HOLEP is clinically proven to be the superior procedure, it is very rarely done, while TERP is done on a regular basis. This is because there is a large learning curve in HOLEP. The surgeon lacks the ability to retract and cut tissue at the same time and operates through a center of motion very close to the target. We have designed a handheld robot to make this procedure easier. The robot is composed of three modules, the user interface, the transmission, and the endoscope. The user interface section contains nine motors and quick connects to the rest of the robot. The surgeon grips the handles and manually moves the entire system while controlling the robotic arms with the joysticks and triggers embedded in the handles. In the transmission section, lead screws translate carriers which move the tubes in and out, while square shafts transmit torque to each tube to provide rotation. A standard endoscope provides the optics and light source, and we pass two manipulators through the 5mm working channel. Additionally, because this robot is handheld, we have designed a spring-loaded counterbalancing frame to take the weight of the robot off of the surgeon's hands. In this video, our system operates on a prostate model. The right arm cuts with the laser, while the left arm retracts. Much of this procedure was done without manipulating the endoscope indicating that the dexterity provided by the robot may make this procedure easier for the surgeons. Lastly, to more accurately assess our system, we have proven feasibility on a cadaver prostate. In a clinically realistic setting, our system removed intact an entire lobe.